It's a very simple mechanism. You can see there's actually only a couple of bodies and a couple of links, but because it incorporates all sorts of interesting impact and friction, you end up with some really interesting behavior if you set it into motion. So you can see that the, the woodpecker, as he moves down the pole, he's doing this sort of repeating cyclical motion. Right now, the woodpecker is, is held in place by the friction on this sleeve against, that, against the wire. But as, we, as you put him into motion, the impact of his beak against the wire actually sort of releases this coupler and releases this sleeve, and he sort of undergoes this repeating cyclical motion again. So again, it's a sort of an example of how a very simple mechanism when you, when you combine all these uh, all these really complex behaviors that's a, that are associated with stiction and, and friction and impact, you can get really interesting dynamics. Here's the woodpecker in super slow motion, filmed with a special high-speed video camera. Zooming in up close, you can actually see the slider break free of the rod's friction just before beak impact. Notice how gravity and the spring coordinate to provide this very interesting motion.